guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a tested out hit or miss video and I'm testing out these Stila highlighters. They're called Heaven's Hue Highlighter, but they're not just like a normal average highlighter. They have like, they're putty. Like they literally can, do you see that? It's a putty. Why am I out of focus? Girl, this is my second video I filmed today. So my camera's trying to act a little crazy and it needs to straighten out. Excuse me, ma'am. No. And get with the picture anyways i thought it would be interesting to do a first impressions so sadly i wiped off the highlighter i had on and like redid my upper cheek makeup so i would be able to test these out on a fresh face i still have my nose highlight on so we won't be highlighting the nose today they just sent to me and i was like what the what what are these and i'm so excited to share them with you guys <laughs> Cause they're a little weird and if something's a little weird you know i'm gonna test it out for you guys so i hope you're excited to see this video also if you didn't see the video on this look well all my nose itches <laughs> i'll link it down below i did like a first impressions video and i used the new carly bible palette on my eyes so without further ado and i'll get off all these rabbit trails i keep running on let's go ahead and jump right in and get started subscribe to my channel before you leave <laughs> i forgot to say that Okay, jumping in, I have three of them. I think there are only three colors. There's a bronze one, a kitten, which is one of their best colors, and transcendence, which is the hollow color. So let me show you. Okay, it's more of an iridescent, not really a hollow color as... Oh my god. Now watch. Oh, do you see like the water that... Is that water? Oh yeah, it's like a liquid that just poured out of it. Do you see how it's just like... You could like write your name in it. How strange. Oh, I could just play with this all day. It's, I've never, honestly, dead serious. It feels different than the ColourPop. Uh, it feels a lot different than the ColourPop because I know those are a little putty-like. It feels, I've never felt anything exactly like it. It kind of feels like, it just feels like putty. Like, if you ever played with putty, it's what it feels like. So, swatching it, they are, I think because of the putty texture, this one, it doesn't have a lot of pigmentation. Do you see how it's kind of like lightly frosted on my hand? And I don't really see the iridescence in it. I see it on my finger, but not really on my hand. So let's swatch the other ones and see, gather our thoughts. Okay. So let's try Kitten. I'm real excited about Kitten. Girl, I wore Kitten. Um, I bought the single eyeshadow like many moons ago and I wore it on my eyelid like every day for like a year. So I'm very familiar with this color. So again, let's just play in it for the satisfaction of watching me do it. Ooh. Look at that. That's so interesting, right? Huh, okay, it's kind of satisfying just playing with it. So, the kitten color with my finger, it actually has, I think, a bit more pigmentation than the Transcendence. Look at that. Now, that one is pretty, yeah, so this one is more pigmented. Yeah. I, like, destroyed it. I didn't really, I mean, it just, like, could mold right back into what it was. It's just so much fun, you know? Okay, let's move on. <laughs> kind of obsessed here. All I want to do is be touched. Now the bronze one, which is like a goldy bronze color. It's so pretty. Let's just swatch this one and see what the business is about. Ooh, this could be a pretty eyeshadow. It definitely shows up, but if you can see, it's subtle. Like you could put this all over your cheek or body and like have a beautiful bronze glow. But you see how it's somewhat subtle, just kind of subtle, has that kind of golden highlight to it. So I'm excited to see how these show up on the cheeks first we're going to try kitten because it seems like that one wants to show up the most because this product is very dense a little fan brush or a little fluffy brush isn't gonna i just know it's like a wet product it's not gonna pick it up so i'm gonna use a little bit more of a dense brush this is the y10 from morphe and swirl it around to really pick up some product oh yeah see that worked are you ready kids um wow that's Freaking amazing. Woo, that's pretty. What do you guys think? Oh, I did not see that coming. Oh my God, we about to take this nose highlight off right now. All right, I have to try it on my nose. My nose looks shiny because of the lighting, but I just took off my nose highlight. Oh. <gasps> 
I just want to put it all over me. Oh, okay, no highlight. Oh, so this is everything and more. <laughs> and I love that I applied it with this Y10 brush because it was like a mini kabuki where it was able, it was more dense, it was more able to grab the product. Do you ever just feel a product and you're just like, girl, I know what I need to do here. You could definitely apply it with your fingers as well. My finger was picking up so much pigment. Next up is Transcendence. I really want to try this one out and I have another, it's like a different shape. A little dusty little cat hair never hurt anything but this is the g34 brush and i'm gonna do the same business with transcendence it looks like a lavender powdery situation <gasps> okay the swatches shit on this product because girl <laughs> excuse me why is this so pretty and you can totally see the iridescent purple. <gasps> I'm shook. I, I was watching it, I was kinda like meh, 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 and now I'm like, oh, okay. It's kinda everything. Girl! Okay, this may be my new favorite highlighter. All right, now we have bronze. I am gonna try a little bit of bronze around my forehead area because we got to. You know, I was just gonna try out two of them, but I'm, I'm like left here shook, screaming. I'm looking for another brush. I know I got one in here. Just gotta find it. Cool, we'll just use this dirty brush. I cannot find a brush to save my life. It makes me so sad. So we're just gonna put this little kabuki on. <laughs> That's a lot of product. I'm scared of my room and makeup. Let's see. at that golden hue. It's like the same situation. I mean, I shouldn't be putting this all over my face like this, but. Honey, let's do this, watch. Mm -hmm. So I wouldn't say this one so much as bronze. I would say this is just more golden because I see like more of a golden hue out of it. Did not see it being that intense. What do you guys think about this product? Leave a comment down below and tell me your thoughts. I honestly had swatched these in the past, but it had probably been a month ago. I didn't recently get these, um, and I had to look up and see if they were still for sale because they're not a brand new product, but I um, just thought about them. I was like, oh yeah, shoot, I wanted to review those. So I was like, let me review them today. Ma'am. Excuse me. So they're not a super new product, but I, like I said, I looked up and made sure they were still for sale. What do you guys think about them? Have any of you guys tried them? What are your thoughts? It just looks so wet and like beautiful on my skin because it's a putty and not a powder. So you don't even have to like melt it down with a setting spray because it's already melted down for you. And I think that's what I'm so just like in awe about because something that I always do with my highlighters is put a little bit of setting spray on top of them and like put a beauty blender on them to make sure they're melted into my skin so you don't have that ashy white powdery look um and it's more like a glow like a wet glow these you don't have to do that with because it's a putty this product is genius and dad gum i've had good luck with products lately um in my first impressions video that i did Try again in a few seconds. that is so scary Literally, the Google talking thing in my living room just started talking to me. <laughs> it scares me. I'm home alone. Oh. Like, literally, is there a murderer in my house right now? Because, girl, we about to go. Lord Jesus, don't let me take these hoop earrings off because once I do, girl, it is over. I approved these. These are a 100 literally approved product. I keep looking at my highlights because I'm obsessed. But I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for being here and watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this little first impressions hit or miss video. And I'll have everything I talked about linked down in the description box down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave. And I'll see you all in my next video.